Hello everyone, Sigler here. Pork, chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. So, we have crossed a, well, like, a line, I'd say. I mean, 300 followers? That's insane. <laughs> I didn't ever expect me to, to like, for, for all of you to like my content that much that you would actually consider to subscribe. And I, I would, like, I really appreciate that you did i mean i'm gonna share some statistics and like uh, well maybe this would be like a i thought this would be like a like celebration video pretty much and like a little bit of a backstory of who i am because there's a lot of new people here and maybe maybe a lot of people don't know who i am i mean Obviously, I'm not like that big or anything, but it could be fun for people to actually get to know me and like, who is this person? And like, what's my background and pretty much everything about like what I've done previously in like co as a content creator. And I thought it could be fun. So first of all, I just want to say thank you everyone for like choosing to believe in me and like with all the positive the feedback i've get, gotten the all the nice comments and everything sure there has been some like trolls out there but like sometimes even the trolls have a point in something that they might say but yeah just thank you and i'm hoping to i i really hope that you will like stick around and we, let's make this journey together and yeah because like for some people um for some people i'm i'm like a random dude on the internet on youtube <laughs> i mean lately like the past 28 days we there has uh, there there is 84 new subscribers to this channel and i mean if I've gotten zero, I still wouldn't be sad because like even because I know that in order for something like YouTube, for example, like even if I would would be able to make a living out of this or not, I would still post because I'm really starting to enjoy this more and more and more. And yeah, so. Who am I? Well, I'm Fredrik, uh, is my name, and I'm from Sweden. And I'm born 1990. I was born uh, in a, well, in, in town, but I, I grew up in a small village. And in it's like uh, in the middle of Sweden, uh, pretty close to Norway. And uh, yeah, I grew up uh, on a farm. Uh, my dad was a farmer. My mom was was uh, home with us and she was also like working in the kindergarten and as a uh, like working with the elderly like you you drove home to them and uh, like just just took care of them and yeah I have two older sisters so I'm the youngest one and yeah I, I think I really my gaming my gaming uh, interest sparked at like around like nine years old i think and when i was turning uh <clears throat> and when i was turning 10 my parents actually bought me a playstation one with spyro the dragon on it and from there it's just been ongoing <laughs> so yeah i'm that's a small like backstory of who i am at my Earlier stage, I, uh, er, earlier stages, I guess. But yeah, uh, let me just show you some statistics. What has happened lately? Um, like this is insane. I mean, uh, the like we are past even the three hundred and three hundred and six. And like I said previously. 84 subscribers in 28 days like i'm 
super stoked and I really appreciate that you consider to do this. And yeah, I mean, I started uploading a little bit more serious in December. Um, let me switch place. There we go, so you can see the dates. So as you can see over here, on the uh, 17th, I actually uploaded like my like first guide, I'd say, which is uh, which was this one, where I basically like did just show a AOE farm that you could do in Barrens, and yeah, from there I thought like, well, this is kind of fun, and like, why not continue? And the reason why I started again with a lot of content because as you can see, uh, let's go into the last page and see when did I, I have a lot of different like weird stuff on, on my YouTube page, but my first video was actually uploaded uh, in, let's see here, in two, 2013. So that's like 10, that's 11 years ago. So I've been around for uh, for some time, uh, on and off, of course. But uh, so I started again now in December, and it's been uh, like five months already, and I think I posted pretty regularly. Um, I mean, from then I I made a lot of videos just about topics that are like I'm coming up with ideas on the go and I also have like a list of ideas that I can make videos out of and stuff like that so I've been around for a long time and previously I was actually a live streamer as well not the big one or anything but same thing there the first ever live stream I did as a test was in was 11 years ago so this is of uh, this is obviously not all of the live streams it's just like highlights and stuff because to my understanding the like real live streams the longer ones get like they disappear now so this is like the old highlights and stuff like that that I start like I chosen to save and as you can see I've been playing uh, World of Warcraft like for a very long time and well it the first one was in Mr. Pandaria but I played long before that I've been playing since like 2000 and I think it was like at the end of I think I dinged level 70 on my hunter on my first level 70 whenever uh, Sunwell Plateau actually dropped so, and I played that one up until Lich King when you could do the refer to uh, refer a friend or whatever. And me and my cousin uh, leveled and I did my paladin because I had fallen in love in his paladin. So back then I did actually account share a lot uh, with my cousin because he liked playing Hunter, uh, I think. But I borrowed his paladin because I got hooked with the idea that WoW hubs did, like the hubs way of pulling back in the day. And I thought it was like so insane that you could pull so much, making so much gold and like boosting people. And just the, the idea of just boosting and helping people because that's something that I always like doing. And <clears throat> I'm the type of person in, in WoW that whenever I'm in town and anyone is like, oh, please give me five gold, I'm like, here, have ten. Like, I'm that person. Because it's like, I don't play that much anymore. Uh, I've always given up out, like, gold. But, like, nowadays, I don't play as regularly as I did back in the day. And it feels like this person probably has more use of these 10 gold than I have at the moment because I'm not playing most likely and maybe they play less than me but it feels like good to give 
and also it feels nice that they might have a more uh, more use of this gold than me so yeah and from from the lich king i remember that i didn't level 80 because you could level so fast with a refer a friend and like on my paladin he was playing hunter then i think i think it was but yeah i i remember that i tanked at like uh I dinged, and the same night I got invited to a guild, and we did clear next Ramas 25. I it was not the first week or anything, but it was like maybe a month after the release, so they had already cleared it, and they were like, "Well, we have a spot left, so here you go." And like the first one, I got so decked out on the paladin, like as paladin tank, that I almost had full bis after one week, which was so fun. But yeah, I've, I've always played pretty much every single tank, every single expansion. Uh, maybe not the later ones, because I, I, I started to lose interest in, like, I think it was like after Legion. I haven't really enjoyed retail that much anymore. I'm more of a classic person, but that's just me. But I mean... That's just a backstory and wow. But I, I've been playing a lot of games. I like to play older games. Bani Kasui is one of my favorite games of all times. Like both of them. And yeah, I've been playing a lot of different games. I like Diablo, everything. Subnautica is like one of the probably like the second my second favorite game of all time like both of the games but also um i got to a point when during my before i met my wife and stuff like that i was working and i did live stream and pretty much nothing else so my like diet consisted through like so much garbage that i felt like i need to do something about this but back then, I did not like enjoy cooking that much be just because I was making food for myself. Because back in the day, I lived in a one-room apartment with a kitchen and bathroom, which was very small. And I thought, like, maybe I could do, like, a cooking channel. So that's what I did. I made a... Uh, it's not actually here but yeah I, I did a cooking channel back in the day um, called Fredrik well cooking food but it's, it was in Swedish and I, I think I like I was actually actually doing it for a couple of years I think I think it was the first one was in 2014 so that's the same year as my, I met my wife, because I met her the summer of this. So, and the last one was like in, it was even longer. Well, I, I think it was like a year or something like that, but it was like 50 episodes, because this is not the actual one, like the last one, because I'd made even more ones. And back then I was not a chef. I am a chef now because I've, I've gone through chef school. So I'm actually working as a chef at the moment, which is awesome. I really love my job. I really, really do my new job. It's awesome. And the workplace is just great. And my boss is awesome as well. But yeah, I've done all different kind of things. And at a certain point, uh, around this time like three years ago I it was maybe a little bit before that but I met another streamer uh, under the name Igor's there on Facebook and Twitch so if you haven't followed him make sure to do so I met him and I've been friends with him for a long time and he's from America and he was like you should go over to Facebook which is like 
back then it was a very very like nice uh, compliment or like a good thing to do because back then at a certain point twitch wasn't that like great and facebook was growing a lot and he was like growing immensely so i was like because i was part of his chat and everything that it was like i started to get recognized so i was like okay let me do it let me make a channel well this was my cooking uh, facebook also so but i made a facebook page page called swedish chefs but the problem with it was that i got copy striked because i am not swedish chef because they uh, it, it was like a copy strike because of the muppet to my understanding so i could not get the like partner button thingy so you could start like people could send you the stars which is uh, equivalent to uh, sending bits on f twitch so i was like hmm that's weird let me do another one so i made bork which is the one that i actually use i i haven't posted anything in a very long time yeah this is my daughter my youngest daughter she's over one and a half years old and i have three kids and one stepdaughter and a wife since eight years back and i've been with her for 10 years now but yeah uh it's like a little story about who i am what i've done and let me show you this we are super super close i mean when i started this was like way over here the subscriber and this one was like at 100 i think whenever i started so we have grown a lot and by this pace who knows maybe we would be able to click this uh, like apply now to be qualified that would be cool but it's like nothing that i like i'm expecting but like if people like if you like my content if one person likes it that's fine with me if no one likes it that's also fine with me because i would i'm gonna post videos anyway because after so many years of this game and i've been playing i i've never stopped playing this game i've never canceled my wow subscriptions well uh the past couple of years i've been playing it for free because i've been buying the wow tokens from the real gold in game but i have a lot of knowledge i feel like i'm not a pro let me tell you that i'm not like a that um i'm not gonna like raise myself to be like above everyone else i am absolutely not like better than anyone else in this game but i feel like i can contribute like with a lot of information and stuff like that and it feels like at least we are i'm doing something right because a lot of you is liking my videos and commenting that i'm doing great and i should keep it up which i'm gonna do so yeah what what can i say i'm really enjoying this i appreciate you all and i mean it's this is insane i i i can't really believe that we've had the growth together let me tell you that i'm not doing this journey alone i'm doing it with you with you borks out there <laughs> but yeah um thank you again i i've probably said thank you a thousand times but it feels like it's not enough and i hope to see you in the next video and if you click on this video you can see why i'm gonna play a dk in cataclysm and the reasons why pretty much and click on this one and i see you over there and i'm gonna greet you with a hello everyone <laughs> so yeah take care and thanks again work work <laughs>